welcome back to another video. Today is Thursday. The 25th is my baby's birthday. I said it's 23 today. Um, yeah. I'm getting ready to have my first colonoscopy tomorrow. I'm having it tomorrow. So I, <laughs> I've been on strict diet for like the last three days. But then for the last today, I've been on liquid diet all day. My surgery, I mean my procedure isn't until 11.30 tomorrow. I'm hungry. I'm hangry. Okay. Anyway, so this is my, it came, this is the box. So Flav, this is the medicine that I have to drink tonight at six o'clock. So it's five o'clock now. I'm gonna mix it up and put it in the fridge so it can get cold. But um, I gotta, this is the flavoring. So I gotta fill this up with water. I think, yeah. And then put this flavoring in it and then drink at six o'clock. I have to drink this um, eight ounces every 15 minutes. And it's supposed to take me an hour to get through this whole thing. Then I got to do it again at midnight. I'm tired now. Like, how did I just gonna assume? I guess I should take a nap. I might as well go to sleep because I can't eat. I'm so hungry. Like I started, like usually I can go, I, I go a long time. What I eat if I ain't thinking about it. But I think today my body knew that I couldn't eat and that I was hungry like at eight o'clock. My stomach was hurting. But anyways, I just was drinking my, eating the popsicles, drinking my chicken broth, and that's it, water. I'm drinking water. But anyways, I'm ready to put get this mixed up so I can put it in the fridge so that it can be cold when I have to drink it at six o'clock, which is 5.03 right now. So I'm here, I can get it in there so it has time to chill. And they said, do not put it in the freezer. So, yeah, I've got a second one of these in here. So, I gotta, why does this one feel heavy? What's the thing? But I'm not looking forward to this. I've been putting it off for a year. <laughs> My doctor's like, I'm gonna keep scheduling it. Do you, boo? No. But no, nah, um, I'm just, I'm tired. I'm just, I'm so hungry. <laughs> And, but today's my baby birthday and everybody always requests Mexican for their birthday. So I'm getting ready to go look up on Mexican feast that I can't eat. He's like, now you know how I feel on Lent. <laughs> I'm like, at least you can eat something. I can't eat nothing. But anyways, um, so let's go mix this up and get started, I guess. And then, oh, so I got to be at the doctor at, at the hospital at 1030 tomorrow. And then my procedure starts at 1130. And they said she last... Wait, Anastasia's supposed to be calling me. <sighs> Anastasia was supposed to call me today and they did not. The pre-op people called me, but... Oh, and then, like, they were saying that Anastasia would call between 4 and 5. It's like, after 5 o'clock. And I had been calling them for two days. <sighs> oh, whatever. So, um... That's interesting. Because I had questions. He said that they would answer those questions. Alright, I'm going to call. So let's go in and mix this up and then, um... Get ready to drink this mess. Oh my god, I don't know how many it is. Oh my god. I don't know how to do this. This is disgusting. I hope the straw helps. I can just suck it to the back of my throat. It's so thick. Why is it so thick? 
Set my timer 15 minutes. Oh my God, I gotta do this, what, four or five times for this hour and then another at midnight? Oh my God. Each time is worse than the last, and I feel like it's making my head hurt. Um, this is the third one, and there's still a lot left, so I think I might have. I think I might have like three more of these. Um, this is okay. No, one more. Two more probably left in this. Let's see. Let's see. Pour this in my cup. Let's see. Oh no, one more. Oh, that's like more than eight ounces. What are you doing? What are you reaching for? Wow. Somewhere. All right, so we got one more after this one. This is making my head hurt. When does the bathroom stuff start? <laughs> Not that I'm looking forward to that either. This is so disgusting. Oh my gosh. Why are you drinking with a straw? It's gonna go straight down my throat. Harder and harder for me to drink it now. I can't down it like I did the first two times. Happy birthday to you! Happy birthday, baby! I'm coming out so I'm being scared. We don't bite. Favorite, bro. It's your birthday, Zed. Somebody in here, it's your birthday. Somebody in here, it's your birthday. Somebody in here, it's your birthday. Day birthday, 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 birthday. <laughs> All right, y'all, this is an update. It is, it's 8.30. I got a headache. <laughs> My stomach is starting to cramp up, and, but I haven't gone to the bathroom yet, but I'm guessing I will soon. It's just really been hurting. I'm so nauseous, I'm so nauseous. But the thing about that thing is it kind of makes you like feel, your stomach feel full. I'm just nauseous. And I, well, I went ahead and made the second one so that it can be ready like at midnight when I have to take it. Uh, and put it in the fridge so it can be chilling chilling already because the last one wasn't really that cold and I think that's what made it worse, but Even thinking about it. I'm oh my gosh, I just don't know how I'm gonna, how I'm gonna down a whole nother thing I'm so nauseous, but anyways, it's um This sucks <laughs> Like why and I'm I was thinking before I did my research I was thinking this is like a thing you have to do every year, but thank God it's like this as long as it's good It's every 10 years so I'm like okay cuz I can't I can't do this I'm like they're gonna have to find another way cuz this ain't it this is not the life <laughs> um but yeah so it's just an update um of course I made Mexican that I couldn't eat that was very brutal and very just evil the boys are in there arguing about who has more champion whose team has more champion oh my stomach <laughs> Whose team has more championships and all that? I'm like, okay. But anyway, so I said, I enjoyed his birthday dinner. He's actually going to, um, he's actually going down to Galveston with some friends tomorrow for the weekend. Because the two of it, it's two of them and their little group of friends. There's two of them with the back-to-back birth, -back birthdays. Oh my gosh. Uh, anyway, so they're going down to Galveston. They got a whole little beach house on the, on the, right on the beach. It's a nice house too. I was like, oh, we're gonna have to look that one up and, and try to make a trip or something. But anyways, so that's what he's doing this weekend. Um, 
But yeah, I'm just I'm just ready for tomorrow and get it over so I can eat. I'm hungry. <sighs> Alright, so this is uh, part one, part two coming up at midnight. Hope I should just take a nap and wake up when it's time to do that, but I can't. I, I can't do that. <sighs> I just need to say, y'all, I'm so miserable right now. Um, it's like 12:15. I'm on my second dose. I'm hey, two and a half pounds down. Later, um, I'm on the second installment of the second dose. I think there's like um. It's like four for each one. <sighs> These things are getting harder and harder to do. So, like, I got this one, and then there's two more after this one. Um, my, I, um, I was in the bathroom for like an hour. I was in there for like 30 minutes, and then for the next 30 minutes, back and forth, like constantly back and forth. Um, and I'm down three pounds. So... <laughs> This is, it was scary. I'm like, this is scary. Like, <laughs> I'm trying not to be too TMI here. Like, anyways, it was just, it wasn't, it wasn't gross. It's just a lot. It's just a lot. Anyways, I need to hear up and drink this so I can start my next 15 minutes. I'm so tired. Like, I'm so tired. I went to bed late last night. And then, of course, I was up early for work. And now it's after 12 o'clock and I'm so tired. But let me down this thing and <sighs> almost, uh, and then I started looking at, I started making my plans on what I'm eating tomorrow as soon as I get out the hospital can't do it I gotta get obviously I knew you had to go slow but I didn't know I was gonna be as strict as it is I'm like I was, I was like five guys fries that's what I want five guys I can't even have it it's either like mashed potatoes or jello or like the same stuff I've been doing like for the last three days it did say five. I can't eat bread. Yeah, I can eat bread before, but that might be, I don't know. Maybe I'll go to Panera and get a bagel. That sounds good, too. Every, anything really sounds good right now. I'm just, I'm so hungry. <laughs> yeah, it's going to be like 36, because I had a banana at midnight last night. That's the last time I ate. Today, it's just been chicken broth and water and these freaking popsicles and I don't know. That means tomorrow. It's already been 24 hours since I've had a solid food. It's already been 24 hours. So by the time I'm done tomorrow, actually when they get started tomorrow, it'll be like 36 hours. Because they start at 11.30, which, you know, 30 minutes before 36 hours. So anyways, um... I can't even get started. Okay. We just got to go in for it. I just know I was going to throw up after I finished the fourth installment on the last one because I was just, I had to sit here and be still because I'm like, if I move, this is so gross. <laughs> oh my gosh, this is so hard. I'm so tired and this is so hard. I'm just so hungry and I can't go to sleep because I got to do this and I can't eat. Like, this is miserable. <laughs> Oh my gosh, I'm never doing this again. Y'all gonna have to figure something else out. Like in 10 years from now, y'all gonna have to figure something else out on how to get this. How can we have not figured something else out by now? I mean, come on now. How can somebody not eat for a whole day? Like I got meds to take. Like I'm diabetic. I don't think I've ever said that. I'm diabetic. I need my medicine. I can't be going all day without. I need to eat. I can't go all day without eating. Like, here we go. Ugh. Oh my god. I don't know how I'm gonna do this two more times. Y'all, I survived the night. I survived the night. Um, it is about 9.30. I'm getting ready to head out to the hospital. Jay's looking, baby, you're looking cute. What's with this light? All right, y'all. 
we just made it about to go in i'm earringless lotionless deodorantless <laughs> not a good day well it is because you ain't funky though i'm not i soaked in a long you clean a little <laughs> ashy but you clean <laughs> all right oh i'm so scared i'm nervous okay but i'm hungry so i'm gonna have to get this done so we can go eat for real and what are we gonna eat oh, everything oh everything everything all stay right. tuned for that all right, Jay gonna keep y'all updated while I'm in here. Anesthesiologist um, and the nurse. They got her IV started and everything. Say she's gonna have about a 20 minute nap. So it's gonna feel like she's at three minutes, I think is what the anesthesiologist said. So we just out here, we're waiting. I got my, uh, I got a pager. And they're gonna call me up to the front desk and then take me back there with her to wake her up. So uh, we'll keep you updated. Talk to the doctor. No. They don't talk. They don't keep talking. I heard people talking and I woke up and I said, Am I done being violated? Oh, you're so crazy. You're so crazy. They said, Did you have a good nap? I think too good. You said you think too good? She said, oh. I think she had too good. She well, this said, is. This is your food, honey. You've been waiting on this for 36 hours. I took my first hours. meal and I was 36 hours. She said I had a polyp. All right. She had to cut it out. Okay. It's not uncommon. If you have to eat anything I want. She said that? Right now? Mm-hmm. We're going to figure it out. <laughs> All right, y'all, I'm done. Jay went to get the car, and then they're going to pull me around with the wheelchair. Mm. <laughs> Just take me up so that I don't bleed out. This is for no allergies. And then this is because she stuck me once and couldn't get the vein. Put it in there and it didn't work. So they had to put it on this arm. But it went good. Let me really eat. I can eat anything now. Thank you. Where, how far are you guys driving? Thank you. you. Thank you. All right, y'all. Um, she brought me to Outback. <gasps> it's raining. It's storming. It's like dark out there. You see how dark it is? It's 12 o'clock. The wind is crazy. They said there was a, when we were checking in, they were saying there was a tornado warning. But anyways, they got something new on the menu. Chicken bites. Sriracha chicken bites. Dang, I don't know. I don't know. You get the wings, I get the bites, and then we can and then I'm getting my pasta. But I won't wait. I won't Hi, how are y'all doing? Good, how are you? Good, good. Happy Friday. Yes. My name is Sam. I'll be taking care of y'all. Okay. Can I throw y'all something to drink? Um, just water for me. Water? Got the pepper. Do y'all want to start out with a blooming onion or some cheese fries? Um, I want to do the try the bites. Oh, those are so good. Oh, I'm excited good. for you. <laughs> They're that good. And can I get y'all some bread as well to get started with? Uh, yes. yes. Do you want to do the wings yeah. later? Do the cocoa bars? Yeah. Okay. Um, do you want mild, medium, or hot? Wait. And it comes with blue cheese. Would y'all rather have ranch? Ranch. Or you can have ranch and blue cheese. Just the ranch. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'll get that going for y'all. Okay. Thank you. 
I don't know if I want the pasta, because I want a baked potato, so I don't. But I want the pasta, but I want some baked potato. Get it, Dang. get it on. Get it on. <laughs> he said get it out because I yeah, I'm hungry. We'll take whatever we'll take whatever you want. That is true. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, they brought us our bread. I'm gonna cut it up. Jay just went to the bathroom. Ugh. The lightning, it's lightning and thundering out there. That thunder is hitting hard. I had to check on my baby girl. Xavier's at work. I had to check on Kaya because she's home by herself. Isaiah's at, she's out of school today. And Isaiah went back this morning for, um, what you call it, Galveston with his friends. Mmm, I'm ready to go hard. When I woke up, they gave me um, graham crackers and uh, cranberry juice. I thought I was gonna be like, cookie monster eating when I got to eat again. <laughs> but I wanna take his clothes off and get sick. She better get a, a she better get a, a, her notepad out for my order, baby, because the list goes on and on. <laughs> I'm out there. That's okay. We can share. I know. And you said I have more for later. Plus, I made all that Mexican last night, so that's my dinner tonight, too, baby. All right, y'all. They brought out these chicken bites. Oh, they don't look like the pictures. Sriracha chicken bites. So I guess it's like sriracha sauce and then they're... I don't think their ranch sauce would go with this, because... Who hot. They were rushing. Hmm? They were rushing. Yeah. They should have cooked these along. I probably would not order these again. You would? I don't think I would. I mean, there's nothing special to me. It's like regular. I mean, I like the sauce, yeah, but I thought you meant to make the chicken to me. It's just regular like chicken tenders to me. Yeah. From where though? All right, go. Here we go, your wings. Thank you. Thank you. All right, I got my little side Caesar salad. Jake got his wings, and we're gonna kind of eat on both of these. And then our meal will be coming out shortly, I guess. Shrimp and chicken, so I got my shrimp on the side so Jake can eat it. Good morning, y'all. Good morning. I am sitting in the backyard. It is so nice out here. It's like real, like just nice. It's not like cold, not hot, barely warm, not chilly, not cool. It's just like perfect. And it's breezy. It's windy, so. Oh no, it's nice out. There's no sun. It's cloudy. It was raining all day yesterday. It's supposed to, I thought it was supposed to rain all weekend. But um, I am home. I'm so happy. Y'all, it's over. <laughs> I've been eating. <laughs> um, I think our last clip was at Outback yesterday. After that, we came straight home. I was out. I passed out. And then after my nap, um, we ain't about to knock my camera off. I um I slept wrong too. I got a crook or something in my neck. Jerry already put some icy hot stuff on me. Um, they just turned that whole house up. Uh, oh, I had like a three-hour Zoom call with my family, and so after that, I think I got on the VR, and um, I fell asleep in the metaverse. <laughs> and y'all, I woke up. At 11 o'clock today, I've never slept that long in my life. I'm like, why well, I sleep so late? But it was good. I'm like, this is perfect. So anyways, um, yeah, so yesterday was crazy. They asked me, so look, I always, not the best when I get, like, put to sleep. So they asked me, the um, anesthesiologist, because they didn't call me. They were supposed to call me, like, the day before, and they never called me anyway. That's all another thing. He came in right before they right before they took me back, and he was asking. Uh, he's like, "You have any problems with anesthesia?" I was like, "Uh, coming out of it." He's like, "Well, I'm like, um, I'm like real loopy, real 
like just out of it and I was like I fought somebody once I threw up once <laughs> I don't know. I don't, it, I don't know. It's just crazy. But they always got stories about me every time I come out of my anesthesia. But, um, hey. What's up? You done made something else. Yep. I heated up the leftover Mexican. That's what we were eating. So the, nur the, who was it? the nurse or the doctor told Jay, he's just like, she's been laughing since she woke up. <laughs> I was like, where is he? Like, why is he not in here? Cause like when I first woke, like it's like I started hearing people talking and then I kind of start coming to, and then I'm looking and I don't see him. I don't see nobody. And I'm like, I tried to sit up and I fell back down to bed. And uh, come on baby, you coming? No. Why? <laughs> come out here where dad is. What? Come stand by daddy. Um, what was I saying? Uh, looking for me oh so i was looking around and i didn't see nobody and then so people just i'm just waiting and people keep walking by and i'm like i started saying hello <laughs> I'm like, hello <laughs> and then i started waving i raised my arm up i'm like hey and they just keep just and they had my curtains like it was halfway open i'm like why my curtain open anybody walked by and see me because well, i was still passed out you know so when i woke up my curtain was half open so i'm like no one would ask me. I'm like, where is Jay? Like, I need him here. And um, so I'm just like waiting and waiting. And I'm like looking for a nurse's button on my bed. There's no nurse's button. I'm like, what the heck? I need somebody. And then um, I was like, how can I get attention? So I was like, oh, they had the little thing on my finger. I was like, if I take this off, I bet it'll start beeping. So I took the thing off my finger and yeah, it started beeping. And nobody still didn't come. I was like, <laughs> and the nurse finally went walking by. I was like, hey, she stopped. I was like, my husband, she's like, I'll call for him, I'll go get him. And so she went and found him, whatever, and she, but before he came back, she had come in and she was doing, oh, I think she was doing a thing. Okay, actually, before all that, back up, as I was just coming to, somebody came in the room. Um, she was doing something on the machines. Oh, I asked her, I said, am I done being violated? I was still kind of out of it. She's like, you feel like you've been violated? I say, am I done being violated? <laughs> she just started laughing. <laughs> and then I was like, passed back out again. And I think later the doctor came in and she was trying to talk to me. And I'm thinking, I'm like, all I could think is like, why are you talking to me? And Jay's not here. You said you was going to talk to both of us when it's over. So I'm like, where's Jay? So she's talking to me. And I'm barely like, out of, in barely like, coherent I guess and um, she did tell me that she found one large polyp and cut it out or whatever but um, uh, I don't know I don't remember what I was saying or something but I guess I was just laughing I don't know and then the nurse that was in there she's like did you have a good nap and then the doctor was like I think she had it too good <laughs> it's always a show for the doctors whenever I'm coming coming out of anesthesia what else honey Huh? What else about yesterday? <clears throat> I mean, insert a video clip of when I came in the room, right? You got that? Okay, <laughs> yes. Because <laughs> I can show y'all that video clip. But it's already going to be in the video, honey. It's part of the whole thing. Oh. Y'all see I was eating that graham cracker and I dozed off after taking, after taking my... The, putting the graham crack in my mouth and I dozed back off for like two seconds. I'm glad I can eat again. That was the worst part of the whole process. I didn't feel, I didn't feel any pain or any discomfort or any weirdness or anything um, from whatever, even from her having cut that thing out or whatever. The only thing is I can't take any pain meds. Like, I think she said for a week. Like I have a headache. I had a, oops. I had a headache last night and then now this hurting and my crooking my neck and waking up wrong and but I can't take any because she doesn't want me to like bleed or anything so right since I have since she's you know cutting the area or whatever she doesn't want me taking any kind of blood thinners I guess which what headache pain medicine is so he had her practicing his swing he got on a, he got on a lot of colors <laughs> Isaiah's chilling, living his best life down in Galveston. He FaceTimed us yesterday when I got there. That house is nice, too. I'll put, see if I can put a clip of some of that house in here. 
But Sakaya, I, I'm gonna put, no. I wish I could see her hair. I don't know if she let me use this picture, but uh, she was taking her braids down Yes, last two days, started Friday. I cut it, cut them and, and got them ready for her. And uh, so she took her braids down. She finished last night and she's getting her hair done today at three, I think. Oh, she's getting it braided for prom next weekend. Okay, just thing is today, my cousin's also, my cousin's prom is this weekend. And she graduates the week after Kaya. Her prom is the week before Kaya, but her graduation is the week after. So we can't go to her. They're having like a send off thing today at 530, which Kai won't be done with her hair by then. So we are going to miss that. Y'all believe my baby graduating? But what we got to do with all these kids gone? We out? We out. We out. Go fill the passport up. We filling up the passports, y'all. <laughs> you know, Sky, we're going to get a message from Sky. But no, we just chilling today before I take this girl to the hair. Uh, and I'm not sitting last. I usually sit with her. Like, I'll sit in the car or something. It was like five hours last time and then this time it's gonna be longer because they gotta wash it first i washed her hair last time but she thicker got too much hair she that sink is too small for her hair and so i like i try to wash it in the sink and it's just there was a struggle so i was like you know what, we'll just add on a wash to your braid style so they can do it in the sink and get it have a thorough wash so I just wanted to come out here and um, end this vlog. This has been our um, colonoscopy vlog. <laughs> but I'm, I'm good, y'all. I'm good. Um, I guess I'll hear back from her within a week as far as <coughs> results and stuff. Thank y'all for rolling with us and we'll see y'all in the next one.